I just got back from my workout, so I thought I'd show you guys what I've been doing for my after workout smoothie. I've been trying out a few different things and I have found a recipe that I really like and it's been working for me, so I thought I'd show you guys how I make it. So first we're gonna add in some frozen strawberries and then about a half a cup of frozen blueberries and then half of a frozen banana. Now here's what I've been doing differently. So I've been adding in a couple of tablespoons of herbal vineyard sea moss. Now I know what you're probably thinking, a smoothie with sea moss, but trust me on this guys, it tastes so good, you can't even taste the sea moss. Next you're just going to add in some milk and vanilla protein powder and blend it all up. It's so good. I literally never get tired of this. And I love that you can't taste the sea moss. So you're getting all the benefits of it without taking a spoonful of it because I tried that, it wasn't for me. So smoothie route, definitely a go-to now. So something that I've actually kind of struggled with is having really bad eczema and psoriasis. A couple years ago, I had it really bad on my face under my eyes. And recently it's gotten pretty bad around my hairline and my scalp. So when I saw that one of the benefits of sea moss was to help with psoriasis, I was super excited because I have tried everything under the sun from creams, shampoos, oils. So I thought, why not this time try out something new? And a lot of what goes on in the outside has to do with what's going on on the inside. So I thought, why not try fixing my gut health and see if that helps? So I've only been taking it for about a week now, but I will keep you guys updated on how that goes.